Welcome to Wizamings, on this day series. Let's get straight to business and see what happened on the 19th of September in history. In 1870 the siege of Paris by Prussian forces begins. As the city could not communicate outside its walls, people inside had to use balloon mail. About 66 unguided mail balloons were released from Paris to communicate with the rest of the country. Since the balloon was not controllable, the delivery of a balloon mail was left to good fortune. But the great majority succeeded in delivering their messages. In 1893 New Zealand becomes the first country to grant all women the right to vote. The Maori were the indigenous Polynesian people who first established in New Zealand. They traveled by canoes called Waka and they named the country Aotearoa, which means the land of the long white cloud. New Zealand's population is over 4 million. But because it is almost the size of Japan, it is one of the world's least populated countries. The country is famous for the world's only flightless parrot, the Kakapo, and for the complete lacking of snakes, beside the fun game. In 1957, Plumbob Rainier becomes the first nuclear explosion to be entirely contained underground, producing no fallout. Before this, another test called Pascal, consisted in the detonation of nuclear charge on the bottom of a 150-meter shaft. The shaft was covered with a 900kg steel plate cap that had to contain the blast. It seems that the cap was projected into the atmosphere with a speed of 66 km per second. That is 240,000 km per hour. The plate has never been found, and it is believed that it vaporized before going to space. In 1982 the smile and frown emoticons were published for the first time by Scott Fallman. The next generation emoji have been around since 1999, when Japanese designer Shigetaka Kurita made the first emoji for cell phones. In 1984 China and Britain completed a draft agreement transferring Hong Kong from British to Chinese rule. Hong Kong City has then quickly developed and it holds the record for the most skyscrapers in the world. There's one distinctive design feature of Hong Kong skyscrapers that is famous. Some of the buildings have gaping holes in the center. The holes are known as dragon gates and according to popular belief, they allow dragons to fly through. People say dragons migrate from the mountains to the ocean, each day, through the holes, allowing positive energy flow through the building. The longest sea crossing in the world is the Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge, 55 km long. The terrain of Hong Kong is hilly, therefore there is peak tram used for transport. Omitting the number 4 is common in Hong Kong, because in Chinese, this number sounds like the word death. This is called tetraphobia. So the elevators, lack the button numbered 4. In 1991, Utsi the Iceman was discovered in the Alps. Utsi is the natural mummy of a man who lived between 3,400 and 3,100 BC. It was found at an elevation of 3,210 meters, on the border between Italy and Austria. Utsi was 160 centimeters tall, weighed about 50 kilograms, and was about 45 years of age. It is believed that he has been murdered with an arrowhead. Based on the tools he had and the copper or traces found on him, it seems that he was involved in copper smelting. Thank you for watching this episode. If you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. See you tomorrow.